noise, the music, the cheering, <laughs> chaos. I can't explain it. I mean, it, and it goes. It's all day long for two solid days. High above the action on the mats, a group of dedicated calligraphers are tirelessly and beautifully documenting the wins and losses of the 2024 State Wrestling Tournament in Billings, Montana. I'm from the old school where they had to write it on the blackboard. Paulette Frazier has been an integral part of this bracketology process for decades now. There are lots of kinds of calligraphies. Um, some of them are very elaborate. I mean, it would take you 10 minutes to do an A or a B. Um, the ones that most of us use are a, a lot like italics that you might see on a computer. So if they're somewhat emulating a computer font, why not just let a computer do the whole thing? Well, they tried that once and the results were not ideal. I can't repeat what the boys say in wrestling. <laughs> The first time they ever had stickers on their boards, they said, what is this garbage? <laughs> and so, This mixture of art and athleticism is something that will be videoed and photographed as a keepsake for years. You have no idea that people that stop and compliment us hour after hour during those two days and appreciate what we do tell us how beautiful it is, how impressed that you can even do that kind of thing. Everyone here is striving for excellence, and even calligraphers have to be ready to overcome obstacles. Normally, no, but yes, I can have hand cramps. <laughs> so a good dose of mustard or pickle juice takes care of that. <laughs> There are around 900 student athletes inside First Interstate Arena this weekend. These young men and women have trained and taken care of themselves for this very moment, for this opportunity to bring home a state championship. And that is something not lost on Paulette and her team. They take their role very seriously. I just want to make sure that the boys get the very best brackets and the girls now, I, I can't forget them.